What's up? It is a Florida winter day with perfect conditions, which is quite rare. But in the Keys, it's actually not that rare. And today we are going out with not only a subscriber giveaway winner, Stevie D, but he also has a YouTube channel, Florida Fishing Friends. Check it out, it's gonna pop up right here. Make sure you give this guy a follow. And today we are going to run right out of here in Key Largo, right out of John Penny Camp, and we're gonna hit the patch reefs and anchor up chum. Look for snapper, mutton snapper, yellowtail snapper, maybe grouper, yellowtail, yellow jack, anything really that comes on by. Anything that has a tail. If it's got a tail, if it's got fins and it swims, it's going in the boat. Yes, sir. If it's legal, if FWC is watching. Yes, which they always are. <laughs> they always are. Yeah, let's get to it. Anchored, got seagulls behind the boat. That didn't take long. It's a little windy out here, but it's it's not too bad. We are now on the patch reefs near the reef's edge, just north out of John Penny Camp. Anchored up in 20 feet of water. Got the chum bag out and uh, time mark to and fish. Yeah, mark and fish and time to drop some baits. Yeah, that didn't take long at all. Do I need to get the net for this one? <laughs> I got it. Case. This was free lining uh, one of those thread fins. Oh, grouper. I can flip them. Nope. A little red grouper. Hey. That's a, Look at that baby. <laughs> That's a beautiful fish. First of the day. It's too small. Let's send it back. Another fish on. Yellowtail? Is it a like yellowtail? I'm going that motor. It's a tail. Oh! Maybe a keeper. Yeah, he's looking good. There's one tail in the box. What's your favorite way to cook them? Whole. Yeah. Love yellowtail skin. Mm. Nice and crispy. Yeah. That's a pretty fish right pretty. there. Pretty. Flag. Not really flag. <laughs> More like a business card. It's a card. flag when you're catching small ones all day. Yes. But Look at it wave. He's good size. He's a good pan size. 12 inches. 12. But buckets 12 inches. But he's he's definitely. He's over. He's probably like 13 and a half. All right. Maybe close to 14. Cooler. All right, in the bag. I'm gonna start with a nice fat pilchard. Nice fatty booba laddie. Goodbye. No, 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 no. Oh, I got a seagull. Ah. Should have brought the shotgun. Wow, these seagulls are relentless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this feels like a keeper. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or I'm just being too easy on them. Woo! Oh! Yellow tail madness. Oh, yeah, that's a nice keeper. One. Yep, yep, yep. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. We got a nice wind rainstorm coming our way it should be hitting us any moment and uh so if we catch a fish probably won't bring out the big camera the big guns we'll see you after the rain is gone <laughs> yellow tail Woo! snacks <laughs> bite size delicious mm, he's a keeper yeah, he's a keeper. Might as well keep him. Woo! Fish in the box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. I don't know what this is, but it's heavy. It's fighting weird. Oh, grouper. Grouper. Look at that freaking grouper. It's not what I'm after, but I'll take it. You. <laughs> There you go. All right, pretty boy. 
Here he goes. I'm on! Oh, that feels like a yellowtail. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! Yeah, buddy. Another keeper. Snacks. He's like the perfect taco. You just wrapped him in a little flour tortilla, he'd be a taco. Fish on, fish on! Oh, what's that? Blue runner? Blue oh, blue runner. That blue runner. It's a good bait. Chunked. Yeah. Do a blue runner catch and cook. <laughs> yeah, we're not that desperate. No, thanks. Yeah, that's a good looking bait. Hold up. I'm going to interrupt this fishing trip to quickly explain the fishing rigs we're using. For yellowtail fishing, I like to use chunks. And as soon as Stevie D caught that blue runner, I decided to chunk it up. Cut it into little half inch chunks and put those on my hook. Now the rig that I'm using is the South Florida Fishing Channel Freeliner rig. It comes in 60 pound fluorocarbon, 40 pound and 20 pound with a circle hook. And in this particular setup, I'm using the 20 pound fluorocarbon with the smaller circle hook. I also have a split shot weight I added onto the rig to make it sink a little bit, and then a chunk of that blue runner. I'm gonna add a link in the video description below to where you can buy these bad boys. Remember, every time you buy one of these rigs, you're supporting the channel and I can make more fishing videos. Now, Stevie D on the other hand, he's using a weighted jig head, kind of like these. These come in all different sizes, everything from an eighth of an ounce all the way up to two ounces. These are called the lip candy jigs, currently in white, great for bottom fishing. I'll also link those in the video description. These just hit the website, so go get yourself some. Now let's go back to fishing. Oh man, they ate that blue, that blue runner chunk they ate immediately. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Guess what we caught on the blue runner. Cannibal! Another blue runner. Woo! He'll get to go free. Although, you guys make pretty good bait. It's beautiful bait right there. Okay. This kind of feels like a yellowtail, maybe? Yeah! Woo! Heck yeah. They're deeper. We're filling the boat slow and steady. Oh yeah, keeper. I think it's a yellow tail. That's a nice one. Oh, that's a real nice one. They're getting oh, bigger. That's today's biggest. Look at that. Yeah. Hey. All right. That's a juicy one here. Oh, Nelly. They love the blue runner chunks. Was that yellow too? You, you. Oh, yeah. Another okay one. Not as big as that last one I got, though. Yeah, delicate white meat. If this was like a slow day of fishing, I probably would keep them, but. Adios, amigos. Yeah, that chunk back. Another keeper. Ooh, that's a good fat, juicy one. He, he's pan sized. Oh, what is that on your face? Oh, got that chum. Yeah, we can feed them. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! Get them! Gotta bring that rod down with that yellow braid. Oh, snap, okay. We'll just get them in the boat and then we'll worry about the tangle later. <laughs> oh, get out of my, get out of my reel. Okay, okay. Oh yeah. Oh. What okay. is that? He is a bruiser. Oh my god, is that a barracuda? Or a kingfish? Oh! <laughs> 40 pound braid. You probably, it was a toothy critter. Yeah, it looked, it looked big. It was big and long. I'm thinking either a barracuda or... On a snapper jig with a little piece of bear, uh, blue runner. Unbelievable. Wow. At least we saw it. Yeah, that was a great battle though. Oh my god. Tangles. He went for the rock. No. I feel him on there. Oh, he went right for the rock. Maybe I can get him to come out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Yeah, he's. I feel him. He's like thumping and everything. He's pissed off. If you played the guitar on him, they don't oh, like yeah. that. 
I don't want to give him slack and let him swim out of the hole, although that sometimes that works. Sometimes it makes it worse. Could go further in. I'll give him a little bit of slack. Oh, oh, mm. I thought he was coming out there. He was doing the head shake, especially on this like light action. There's not much you can do about it. Okay, I'm gonna give him some slack and just, okay, he's got full slack now. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh. Whoa, it's a yellow tail. What the heck was he doing? It's a flag. Oh, look at that bad boy right there. Woo. I thought that was a grouper for sure. Right? Oh man, that's, he's fat. Biggest one today. Look at his little belly. He's oh, a fool from all my chum. Yep. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. That is a good one. 10 minute fight on a yellow tail flag. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Beauty. All right, he's going in the box for sure. Where should we toss him back? No, we're not tossing him back. Be sportsmanlike and uh, you, we throw, we only catch and release on this boot. <laughs> I wasn't even ready for that. Hey, yellow tail. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. He, looks, he looks all right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo! -hoo. Ooh, a feisty yellowtail. Oh, he's all right. He's pretty good. Snacks on snacks on snacks. Oh, he's got a fat belly. Look at that. He's, he's sitting down there uh, reaping the benefits of our chum. Yep. Oh, yeah, he's fat. Fat boy. That was a nice, strong hit. That was good. I like that. Nice, fat, strong. Ooh, I'm on again. Oh, yeah. Woohoo! Wait, what's going on here? Wait a second. How is this blue line on here? Okay, let me get him off the hook. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh, you're on. Oh my gosh. All right, you got a fish on there. <laughs> Reel him in. I can't. Stop reeling. Get him off the hook. Oh my gosh. I. I was trying to and all of a sudden it pulled so hard. Is there still something on there? I don't think so. Oh. Okay, he's he's off. I'm gonna throw him back. Oh yeah, there's a fish on there. You know what? I'm hand line him. I got him. Yeah? Yeah. He's not small. He's gonna hurt. I better not wrap it around my hand. Ooh. Oh man. oh man. Oh man. Gloves would be so nice right now. Oh, don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Hang on. Hang on. Oh. What is it? What is it? We're back in caveman days. Oh my god. Mutton. Mutton. Yeah. <laughs> Hand lining. Hand lining the mutton. <laughs> oh snap. Look at that. Yeah. Just hand lined this muff mutton in. I'm never using braid on a boat again. Holy cow, look at that thing. Oh, moment of truth. I'm gonna say he's like 17 or something. Just under. Seven, 17 and a, and a half. What do you think? Oh, yeah, I think he's just, just a hair short. Yeah, 17 and a half. Well, let's let him go. There's got to be bigger ones. Yes. We're on them, though. Double hookup going on. <laughs> oh, yellowtail. Ooh, that's a fatty. Fatty, fatty, fatty. I got one, too. Oh, yeah. Twins. <laughs> Woo. We are getting a good amount of yellowtail right now. Double up on the tails, baby. <laughs> It was just taking line. Oh yeah. Oh, it's out. Well, okay, hold on a second. All right, here we go. Bam! Oh, nope. Is that premature? Nope, I'm on. <laughs> That's right, Mr. Fish. Oh, he's trying to go for the bottom. I got him out. No. No! Oh, he's out. He's in, he's out, he's in. What an emotional roller coaster. <laughs> Oh, here he, here he comes. Woo! Yeah, he's taking drag on me. The other ones haven't done that. I, maybe it's uh, not a yellowtail. Oh, it is. A keeper. 
stronger. I like this one. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bam! Oh my, did you see that? <laughs> oh, man, the way it came up and whacked it. Holy smokes. I'm trying to really finesse him right now. The last thing I want to do is lose him. Ooh, that's a big Ciro Mac. Okay. Um, Where's your net? The net's right up there by the cooler bag. Here he comes. Ready for this? Ooh, boy. Ooh, don't lose him now. Ooh, snap. Okay. Here he comes. Holy caboodles. Yeah! Oh! oh. God! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Wow! Woo! Good work, man. That was in... That was in... You were reeling it in. You were reeling in the valley hoop. Yeah. That dude just came right out of the water to hit that thing. Woo! Zero mackerel on the stinger tip. Looking good. We'll bleed him out and he'll be ready to go. Beauty. What a fight, huh? Yeah, that was a good fight. Time for this mackerel to meet his maker. Mackerel is bleeding out. Yeah! Yellowtail! Kazam! All right there, buddy. Oh yeah, he's a good one. You got yourself a nice fish there. Wrapping the rope. I don't even think the hook's got him. Yeah, he's looking at that fish like, why are you holding? He thinks the fish got him. Come on, we're gonna safely release you. As long as you don't bite me. He's not happy. Bye. Oh, he got off. The question is, will he do it again? Well, we've got. I don't know how many yellowtail snapper we have, like 14 maybe, that. around that. Got a nice mackerel and we're gonna head back home. But before we go home, we're gonna troll some feathers, some plugs, troll the patch reefs here between 10 and 20, 30 feet of water on the way home. Maybe we'll hook into something, but let's get back before another storm comes. I'm watching these clouds around here. <laughs> Stubborn. He is heavy. Oh my god! Oh, big Jack! Jack, Jack from Bell. I'm gonna keep him actually because. Actually, I wonder if we could fling him in. Oh! Oh! Oh, he's still on! He's still on! He's still on! Can we win? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna flip him in, man. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Don't. Uh, maybe flip him in from the back so you don't have to lift him too high. Okay. Okay. channel baby get the big ones
just like that, we're back to civilization. And we got cotton candy pink skies. <laughs> Beautiful. You want to eat some yellowtail for dinner? Yeah, I'm starving. I'm waiting for you. I haven't eaten anything. Oh, look who it is. Typical little guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh, I thought for sure we had fourteen. It's tough to count them. Good day. Yeah, I can't complain about that. Are you gonna make a sashimi out of that? <laughs> you know what? I might go ahead and go right to Lazy Lobster with this right now. Oh. And have uh, the chefs over there do it up. That sounds pretty good. good That's the best idea on the market. Uh -huh. I'm starving and I got a long way home. Well, alrighty then. What a day. That was freaking awesome. I'm gonna cook my yellowtail whole, I think. Deskill them, gut them, cook them whole. I'm going to Lazy Lobster. Shout out Lazy Lobster. Heiko recommended it. Lazy Lobster's a good place to go. Yes, Man, sir. I, I had a great time. Me too. Good having you on the boat. Me too, brother. South Florida Fishing Channel. Florida Fishing Friends. Check us out. The link. <laughs> right below <laughs> yeah man i will see you again soon we're out of here and it's time to make dinner with the lady peace out so i got two yellowtail snapper that we're gonna have for dinner here and i ripped their gills out and i took all their guts out so they're and they're these scaled they got no scales so what we do is we dry them with a paper towel oh kitty's already begging <laughs> That didn't take long. The reason you dry them is because if they're too wet, the breading won't stick that well to them. So we just want to give them a nice general pat down. That's good. Then we got our bag here. We're going to do something a little different. Cornmeal. Uh-oh, look who it is. Buddy. That right there is the face of desperation. He'll get some, don't worry, but not right now. Put some cornmeal in a bag. That's plenty. Put some Everglades seasoning or whatever seasoning you like for some extra flavor. Now here's where it gets exciting. Shake and bake. Hot and spicy. We'll put one bag of that in there. I've never done this before, but we had it in the cabinet and I thought, why not? Ooh, that smells good. You smell that? Take a whiff of that. Oh wow, this one's really good. Ooh. And then we just plop the fish on in there. We'll do one fish at a time. Since the tails are on them, can't really close the bag. So we'll just do this as best as we can. Or actually, no, yeah, we can't close the bag. Here we go. Get it all up inside of the fish too. And he is ready to go. Look at that guy. Shake and bake. <laughs> Covered completely, ready to be deep fried. Is this your first time eating a whole fish, Caitlin? First time. Oh my gosh. I know, you do it all the time. I do it all the time. Here we go. Two beautifully basted yellowtail snapper. We have a bowl of super hot peanut oil. Oh my gosh. Oh, uh, okay, this is why I normally cut the tail off, because, as you can see, they don't fit. Hmm. That's okay, we'll flip them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I ripped... I ripped the yellowtail tails off. Made room in the pot. What you making over there, Caitlin? Macaroni and cheese. Macaroni and cheese. Mm -mm. Real fancy. Real fancy appetizer for a real fancy dinner. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can already see the comments coming in with the mac and cheese on the, with the fish. Mm-hmm. You guys are so unhealthy. It'll be more like Thai don't mix with. What do you mean? It's just a sign. I don't know. What do you? 
Here we are. Do you like sweet red chili? Yeah. All right, put a little bit on yours there. Oh yeah, I always see you do this and I'm always wondering how it tastes. Okay, now like, how do I do this? So it should come right off the bone. If you just like basically- Just take a little chunk or something? Yep. That's what I thought? Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh my God. It's good. That's to die for. Wow. Huh. Now I see why people order it. It's so good. Look who joined the party. Bunnies. Luckily I saved him something. Mousies. Oh. You ready for all the comments about getting the cat off the table? Can't help it. He goes mm -hmm. where he wants. Can't control what a cat it's does. so annoying. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh! Oh no, he's taking the tail. I think he heard us talking about how he shouldn't eat on the table. <laughs> He's like, I'll make all the, make all the fans happy. Yeah, he oh. took the tail and we went down him and now he's eating it on the floor. Just pull, pull the whole red right out. Oh my goodness, look at that. Bam.